Hey folks, what's up? It's Dr. Rod here on Shock Doc Medical, and today I've got something absolutely wild to share with you. Now, you know I get pretty hyped about breakthroughs in medicine, and this one? It's next level. We're talking about rectal cancer, and not just any treatment, but an experimental immunotherapy that's basically making rectal cancer vanish. Yeah, you heard me right, vanish. All right, so here's the deal. Over at Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center, they ran this small but super impressive clinical trial using a drug called Gemperly, or Dostarlamab, if you're into the nitty-gritty details. And get this. In this trial, every single patient treated saw their rectal cancer completely disappear. That's 100% remission, folks. And now, this groundbreaking treatment has just snagged the FDA's breakthrough therapy designation. Pretty epic, huh? Now, let's break it down. The trial wasn't for every type of rectal cancer, though. It was specifically for patients whose tumors have a unique genetic marker, either mismatch repair deficient, MMRD, or microsatellite instability high, MSI. These markers essentially make the cancer cells look so weird to your immune system that once you give them the right signal, your body can go full on ninja mode and obliterate those cancer cells. And the kicker? This means patients can skip the usual hellish combo of surgery, radiation, and chemotherapy. Imagine that for a minute. Instead of having to deal with the brutal side effects of those traditional treatments, like infertility, incontinence, and a whole host of other issues, you get a treatment that not only saves your life, but also lets you keep your quality of life intact. I mean, that's a game changer. Dr. Andrea Sercek and her colleague, Dr. Luis Diaz, led this trial at MSK, and the results are nothing short of astonishing. Out of 42 patients treated so far, every single one of them is now cancer-free. And it's not just a temporary fix. Most of these folks have been free of cancer for at least a year, and some have been doing amazing for up to four years. That's sustained, long-term success that you just don't see every day. One of the parts that really blew me away was the human side of it all. Dr. Sersek mentioned that not only are the patients thriving, but there's even been a little baby boom as a result of this treatment. Three of these patients have had healthy babies since finishing their therapy. Think about that. These are people who would have been facing life-altering side effects from traditional treatments, and now they're getting to live full lives, even starting families. It's just incredible. Now, I gotta tell you, this isn't just about treating cancer, it's about completely rethinking how we approach it. You see, with conventional treatments, we're often forced to accept some heavy collateral damage. But here, immunotherapy is harnessing the body's own immune system. It's like removing the brakes on your immune cells so they can go full throttle against the cancer cells. Dr. Diaz even calls this approach immunoablative therapy a fancy term that basically means using immunotherapy to do the job of surgery, chemo, and radiation all at once. Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? And what's even more interesting, the whole trial has sparked changes in how doctors around the world are treating rectal cancer. The National Comprehensive Cancer Network updated their guidelines because of this, which means insurance companies are more likely to cover this cutting-edge approach. It's like the whole system is waking up to this new possibility. Now, I know a lot of you might be thinking, Dr. Rod, what does this mean for me or someone I love? If you or someone you know is dealing with rectal cancer, especially if the tumor has that specific genetic makeup, this could be a beacon of hope. It's a reminder that sometimes, when we push the envelope in research, we open up completely new avenues for treatment that not only save lives, but also preserve the quality of life. And that's something worth getting excited about. So there you have it, folks. An experimental treatment that's not just treating rectal cancer, but potentially curing it, with a 100% success rate in this trial. It's breakthroughs like these that make you realize just how far medicine has come and how much further it can go. As always, stay curious, stay informed, and keep pushing for a future where we can all live healthier lives. Thanks for tuning in to Shock Doc Medical with me, Dr. Rod. If you found this episode as mind-blowing as I did, be sure to hit that subscribe button, leave a comment, and share this with anyone who needs to hear about this breakthrough. Until next time, stay healthy, folks.